Yee, what's going on guys? Freelu here. And now that the Black Ops 3 beta is officially over on both consoles, you know, PlayStation 4 a while ago and then an Xbox like a week after that, um, I'm finally going to make my sort of opinion on it. I didn't really want to do like a review or like a impression video, uh, you know, like during the beta just because I wanted, you know, obviously I wanted to play the, the, the game and I wanted to... Um, I don't, I don't really like when people do, like, reviews, like, after the game has only been out for, like, a day, it kind of, like, it kind of, I don't know, it's kind of, like, you, you don't really get the full feel of a game when you only play it for a day. I mean, almost any game is amazing on the first first day when it comes out, when it's released and played, so, you know, I wanted to wait, like, a while, you know, like, after, like, two weeks or so, you, you know, you kind of get the feel for a game, but, yeah, um... You know, obviously, um, I play on the PlayStation 4 a lot more. I've been playing Call of Duty since, like, more for 2 on the PlayStation 3. So, naturally, you know, I'm going to play on the PlayStation 4. But uh, I did, was lucky enough to get an Xbox One this year. So, you know, and my friend, uh, who put my friend, my in-real-life friend plays uh, as much on Xbox as I do PlayStation. And he's pretty he's a pretty cool dude. He's a Lades man. you probably see me play with him a few times on my channel. Um, and he's lucky enough to give me a code so we could, you know, we could play the beta. And, um, yeah, it was, uh, you know, it was pretty fun, pretty cool. I, you know, got to play it, like, I got to play Black Ops 3, like, two weeks straight. Uh, unfortunately, you know, I obviously had to re, kind of, re-level up on my Xbox account. So, you know, that kind of sucked, but other than that, it was, it was good. I, uh... You know, it was a uh, it's pretty it's pretty fun game if I do say so myself. Um, like I said, I was just kind of waiting till it was over to, to make sort of a uh, like a review on it. But um, yeah, I was you know like this is obviously gonna be my opinion and my kind of thoughts on the game. Um, so hopefully you know, I mean obviously you guys will have different thoughts and opinions on it. Um, you know, not not everyone likes the same stuff, and um. Yeah, a little bit of the gameplay, I guess. Uh, so, um, yeah, this is obviously this is on the PlayStation 4. Uh, we're playing on combat. I'm using the Man of War suppressed, and I'm using the. I'm trying. To, this is one of like sort of my very first games. Yeah, I'm still level 11. Um, and I'm using. I was trying out streaks and or specialists, and I'm using the uh, the ping girl or whatever that you know you can see through walls and stuff, which is kind of cool. And, um, yeah, so this is going to be my uh, sort of opinion on the beta. Obviously not the full game. The full, you know, like, the full game isn't out till like, November 6th. So I'll just, I'll, you know, I'll just wait till then to kind of make it, I guess. But, um, yeah, overall, I'm just going to say right off the bat, uh, I really, you know, I really kind of like this game. It's really enjoyable. Um, I do like how they kind of, I felt like they were kind of appealing to both groups. The kind of... Um, you know, the, the group that I'm in that actually like the Advanced Warfare Exosuits and the new movement, and the group that, um, you know, and the group that actually, that likes, you know, the regular classic Call of Duties, you know, that want the same Call of Duty every year, because, you know, we haven't had the same Call of Duty for, you know, for what, 10, 10 years straight, or 10 titles? So, <laughs> I, I don't know, I mean, don't get me wrong, I don't, I don't hate classic Call of Duties, but, uh, I definitely do like that. I was a little bit worried, because I when you when you try to please more than one group, it's a little bit hard to do that. But uh, you know, I, I think they did really well with this. The the uh, the threat the the thrust jumping and the sliding and the wall running were great in this. Uh, you know, you're you're more at a disadvantage if you just if you just you know double jump and wall jump and as opposed to advanced warfare where you're more at at an advantage if you kind of like double jump because then you just people like you just double jump rapidly like you know 20 feet in the air and and just suddenly all at once, but this is like a lot more slow. So you're at, you're at a more disadvantage if you use the movements while you're trying to like while you're in a gunfight. You know, if someone's standing still, they're they're gonna win the gunfight more than if you're jumping around. So that that is kind of cool. And you know, I struggled a little bit in the beginning because I didn't, um, I wasn't really used to playing. Ooh, sorry, I wasn't really used to playing a classic Call of Duty because I I was playing Advanced Warfare for like seven months and then. I started playing a lot of Rocket League before this game, before the beta came out on the PlayStation, so that was kind of not a good idea, but other other than that, it's really fun. I, you know, 
adjusted well. If I do, I adjusted sort of well. I remembered how to play classic Call of Duty again. It's really fun. Uh, specialists add in like a new kind of f kind of fun element. It's kind of cool kill streak kind of thing. The streaks are pretty good in this game too. They're so that I'm I'm kind of kind of you know happy, sort of happy about. They're kind of useful. Uh, equipment is quite quite useful again. So. That, I don't know, that I'm a bit of a touchy subject about, um, it's, I'm sort of iffy about, like, I kind of like that because they're useful and they're not useless, but I kind of don't because they're useful again, <laughs> and people, you know, people can just spam it, so it's kind of annoying. Um, what else? The, I mean, we only played four maps, but out of the four maps, I did like two of them. I like Combine and, and Stronghold, I don't really like Evac or Hunted, but, um... Yeah, other than that, like I said, it's a pretty fun game. Uh, I did not know you, should, you could shoot through that wall there. It was just kind of weird. But um, other other than that, it was uh, you know it's pretty fun. It's pretty fun. The I mean the, even the beta, even for a beta, it was pretty fun. So that was uh, that was pretty cool. And um, so yeah, so that was overall. That's kind of my overall opinion on it. Like it, it's good. You know, it's Call of Duty. I like Call of Duty anyway. You know, I mean if you're subscribed to me, you probably like Call of Duty too. So. You know, it's a really good Call of Duty. Like I said, it's it's pretty it's pretty fun. You know, the, the, all the new stuff that they added in works well. Nothing is sort of broken or you know doesn't feel right. So that is good. That I do like. And um, so that's sort of my overall. But I'm gonna get a little bit more in depth on these.